Welcome to week three of the SPL. I am your coach for the Las Vegas Corviknights, and this is our team. My opponent has a really strong team with major offensive threats like Dragon Pole, Masquerada, and Cinderace. And his defense isn't lacking either with defensive threats like Rotom Wash, Deancey, and Ting Lu. And to break through that defense, we have Chiyu. With our Choice Scarf, we're able to outspeed his entire team and hit them really hard with our dual stab of Flamethrower and Dark Pulse. And if we really need to nuke something, we can hit it with an Overheat. And if we can make a prediction, we can Willow Wisp them. Now for our defensive check, Skarmory. With body press we can do really good damage to his whole team except pole and we can further boost that with iron defense. Roost is there for longevity and iron heads there for coverage. Continuing our defensive theme we have Clefable. Moonblast hits his team really hard. Knockoff gets rid of my opponent's items. Moonlight gives us longevity and Thunder Wave allows us to cripple something on my opponent's team. Dust Noir should be able to do something similar with its ability to will o -wisp our opponent, Pain Split to gain health back, Poltergeist to do a lot of damage, and Leech Life for some added coverage. Making his season debut we have Claude Sire. This is the key to our game. Earth Earthquake deals decent damage to the majority of his team, recovers there for longevity, Toxic Spikes is there to get reoccurring damage on my opponent's team, as well as Toxic for things like Rotom Wash. This should really punish my opponent's team, as our team is really bulky. Last but not least, we have Quackable. We have Aqua Step to give us that speed boost, Close Combat to hit his team really hard, Knock Off for things like Dragon Pole, and Aqua Jet to pick off a weakened foe. And that's my team for week 3, let's get into the battle. He did not bring his Overquill, Claude Sire looks really good, he did bring Rotom. Rotom can't do anything to Claude. What do I think his lead's gonna be? I'm gonna lead Claude. It just seems to make sense. He doesn't really have a great answer to it, and I can get up Toxic Spikes. I do have to worry because he is probably Guts Earth Ring. Deancey, that's fine. He's probably just gonna do Rocks here. Uh, we'll go for Toxic and put this thing on a timer. That is the goal for this uh, whole game is to make sure everything is on a timer. Okay, that's fine. I'm gonna Toxic Spikes. He encores me into that, that's fine. I can just go right into Skarm and uh, start Iron Defensing. He goes into Ursa Ring, that's fine. Sod's not doing a ton. I can just go for the meanest of body presses here. Or, you know what, I'm gonna go for an Iron Defense. Let's see what he's got. And we can also see if we're faster. We probably aren't. He goes straight Polt, that's fine. I'm gonna go Clef. I gotta keep Skarmory healthy. He may Dragon Dance here, but Clefable is gonna be able to take that, no problem. Flamethrower. We live that. He doesn't get the burn. That's good. Do I go for the Thunder Wave here, or do I just go straight for, like, the knockoff? I'll go Moonlight. I'll keep Clef healthy. Actually, I do want to cripple this thing. I'm gonna go for the T-Wave, and then that cripples it if he stays in. He doesn't- he goes Jirachi. That's fine. I do land the T-Wave. Let's Moonlight. He could get paired, and I want to get the health back on Clef Well, He may switch, predicting me to switch, uh, or he could just go for an Iron Head. Here, body slam, that does nothing. All right, we have a free knockoff here. And we get rid of his AV. That's good. He does 50% to us. I'm a moonlight once. Get some moonlight recovery. He gets parried. That's really good turn for us. Polter's doing a lot. We're going Dust Noir on the body slammer Iron Head. Either roar. Iron Head does a bit. That is fine. We can go for the Poltergeist, that's gonna hurt. He may switch here, but something's gonna have to take this Poltergeist. In fact, do I want a Willow? I'll just keep the Poltergeist. He goes to Yancey, that's fine. I'm not taking much, and I can go for the Aqua Step. I'm gonna go Quack. Diamond Storm, plus two defense. That's fine. I'm gonna Aqua Step here. He goes Rotom. Hard Rotom. That's fine. I am... I go Hard Clod here. Goes for the Thunder Wave. I am immune. And we just go for a Toxic Spike here. If he stays in, he stays in. He goes right back out into Deancey. That is fine. I do want to get Toxic Spikes up. So I'm going to go for one more. That way Cinderace is going to be poisoned. Polt will be poisoned. Rotom will be poisoned. Heavily poisoned on the switch. And he goes Ursa Ring. That's fine. He's not doing a ton. I'm going to go Dust Noir. He has a Flame War, of course. Shadow Claw. That was a good play by him. I'm going to go Skarm. 
I don't want to give him an easy kill. Terra normals for Shadow Claw. That's fine. He does take Rocky Helmet. I can just roost off any damage he does here. He's probably worried about a body press here. He goes straight to Rachi. That's fine. I don't think Jirashi can do much, so we're gonna just go for the Iron Defense. It might get, like, Flame Punch. Fire Punch, yep. He gets the burn. That's fine. We'll go for another Iron Defense. He goes Pult. That's fine. Pult does get toxic which is really good. I'm thinking it's a good time to just sack Dust Noir here. So that's fine. Does my first work? He's Choice Specs. That's really good because that does mean we are faster with Chiyu. Yeah, we are always faster with Chiyu and something has to take a nasty Dark Pulse. So that's what we're doing. We are going for the meanest of Dark Pulses here. I'm not sure what he goes for here, but nothing wants to take this Dark Pulse. He goes to Rashi, that's dead. Okay, easy. Deancey, Skarmory is also a good move. We'll just go Skarm. It's gonna body press. That does more damage to him than it does to me. And we're slowly weakening his whole team. We'll roost. Encore into roost. And we'll just go straight Claude. On Cinderace, let's go. So he isn't heavy duty boots. We take one. We do take, actually, we take more than one. So we're going for an earthquake here. Yeah, so he has to be very careful, because his best play is to Pyroball us here. He U-turns, that's fine. That's that's fine, but something's going to have to take an Earthquake. He may go straight into his Deancey. That's actually really surprising. Deancey dies. Ursa Ring, we'll go for an Earthquake. We'll see how much this saw. That did way more than I thought it would. It did a lot. Uh, we'll roost. He went full. I roosted. He actually doesn't have a switch in at this point to Dark Pulse. We'll go Clef. He's specs, so he's locked into whatever he goes for. That's fine. I just get a free Moonlight here on whatever he wants to go. He goes Rotom. I don't have a great answer to this now. We'll go for a knockoff. He thunder waves us. That's fine. I get rid of his leftovers. That's fine. Uh, I want to get damage off on this. He does have hex, which is a little annoying. I didn't see what item he was on Cinderace, so that's a problem. Just because I don't know. We're going to go for a knockoff here. I jump kick. It's an interesting choice. Hopefully I, I get paired. Full paired. That's that's fine. We'll moonlight. We should live one. This will be interesting to see if he is locked into that. Yeah, he's he's for sure choice scarf. So yeah, we just go for a moon blast here. He's gonna hydro. That's fine. Get I get the lower special. Yeah, we'll moonlight. That sucks for him. Please break through. Great. Moonblast. One more time. I get full paired. It's unfortunate. We gotta go for a Moonlight. He misses another Hydro. I'm sorry about that. I get full paired. Our luck is... We're pretty much the same. I'm going to go for Moonlight. Don't get full paired. I get full paired again. It's great. Don't get full paired. I get the Moonlight off. I'm gonna go for a Moonblast. 14. Okay. We go Skarm. That's fine. Cinderace. We go Clef. Pyroball. That's fine. He misses. Do I get the Moonlight off? I do. That's, that's really big. If I can get this thing off, killed... Come on, hit it. Dag nab it. Alright, what is he doing? 40. How much did that poison do? I'm gonna go for Moonlight on the miss. 
Do I get it? I get the moonlight. Oh, that's huge. Alright, so Cinderace is gone. Which means I'm pretty sure we win. I'm gonna Moonblast here. So, Chiyu Dark Pulse just takes it. Moonblast. Clef is actually a monster. <laughs> it's just a le legitimate monster, this game. I cannot believe that. X. Is it over? Did we win? We won! Let's go! Let's go! Alright, well that is an absolute incredible game from Clefable of all people. I misplayed hard last week and Clefable came in and won this week. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I am so happy. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. Peace out.